So it's Joshua taking on Usyk. Who's going to come out on top? I still think Usyk will come out on top. Gary? That. I've trained with AJ. And, uh... <laughs> <laughs> what, did you, what did you do? <laughs> I was on the pads. <laughs> um, no, honestly, I think in that first fight, he, came, he, didn't, he didn't throw his punches, did he? He didn't come out and go for it, that extra strength and that power that he has. I think he's going to come out all guns blazing and go for it, and he's going to do it. I know you're going to do it. Tyson Fury said after the fight that he would wipe the floor with both of them. Your thoughts? Like, you saw the reaction of the guy there. This is a guy in Tyson Fury, right, who openly says he's had all these mental health problems, you know, struggles, stuff like that. You see a guy up there crying, like, as, as big and strong as AJ, who for years has put on a brave face. And tonight, like he said, you just saw chinks in the armour. So if you want to see a guy that's been through this mental health experience and goading someone when they're down and when they're devastated, that shows you the kind of man he is. Am I proud of myself? Uh, it's really, really hard for me to say I'm proud of myself. Um, I don't feel anything. I'm just, well, I'm upset, really, like, deep down in my heart. Like, oh, man. Oh. So Tyson Fury, and this is my defence of AJ. Everyone saying AJ's a bum, he says he's that, he can't fight because lost a few. But AJ has made it in life. The man can go to the pub every single day and drink Peroni if he wants to. He can go on holiday every day. He can play with his kids every day of his life. So I don't want to hear any more of this bullshit about AJ says he's that, he's useless, he can't fight. The man's made it. Be happy for him.